energy roll. I don't, I can't. I was like five years old.
This is Mitch Markovich, original drum instructor for the Royal Airs in years of 1965 for sure. Late National 64 and all the way to 68. There you go. And uh, this is the uh, 2002 uh, drum line for the Royal Airs Reunion Corps. We're at uh, Madison, Wisconsin. Uh, it's beautiful weather today. They're performing tonight at about 10 o'clock or so. Somewhere in there. Somewhere in the 10 o'clock area. Last Koran. Last Koran, as it should be. Yep. Uh, the legend lives on, and it's not uh, being detracted by any means by this core at all. Uh, what are your thoughts on where the core came from uh, at the beginning of practice last September to today in August? Well, we were... Uh, <laughs> We had uh, quite a big turnout compared to what we thought, um, but uh, we were just awful because nobody, you know, most of the guys hadn't touched a horn or picked up a drum for uh, for all, you know, 30 years or more. And uh, what's the average age of the core? Average age is about just about 55 now, and uh, so it's taken these guys a whole lot of effort just to get back in shape. They've done a remarkable job. Uh, I'm just thrilled. I never dreamed we would be at this level at this time. Never dreamed. And uh, but uh, all those old muscles are getting revved up and loosened up and strengthened. And I and noticed you're using the open style of drumming. Yeah. There's an open. There's an open style of drumming you're using, which is you can see it 100 yards away. And uh, we've noticed that we're old drum corps people ourselves, and we've noticed that. Uh, how far away do these people come from? What's, what's, the, what's the span of this core, do you know? Well, let's see, we got somebody from Texas, uh, people from Illinois, Southern Illinois, St. Louis area, uh, Florida, uh, Arizona, uh, California. About how many people in Drumline do you say are from the original core that you that, that you probably I'm thinking we have uh, somewhere in the vicinity of 10, maybe, maybe 12, somewhere in there. So uh, the rest of them are from all other cores, and they have wanted to do this thing so bad and to recreate kind of a snapshot of, of the Royal Airs in, um, in the 60s that uh, they've come on board, you know, and gone at it, you know, just, just phenomenally. Uh, no holds barred. About how many people do we have in the drum line? We've got about 33. 33, about how many? Somewhere horns? in there. Horns are about 80. About 80. And the, and the rest is guard. So it's 170 on the field. 170 on the field. And what's the uh, repertoire that you use? Is this nope. the same 1965 show? It's the 65 show, except for the closer. Uh, and
and uh, we are we just we're doing it's a very good year for a closer and um, we've got another solo drum solo in there from from another year and otherwise it's, it's the same and the Martian is the same yeah all right yeah we, we've tried to recreate I mean the actual drill is not you know step for step the same but it's the, the pictures we've tried to recreate the pictures as much as we can find and or remember and uh, same with the drum music uh, I found most of all the old drum ch charts in my catacombs and uh, are you, I, I no, save everything. <laughs> now, are you? A, uh, I know the staff uh, nowadays. Court drum corps are having staffs of 30, 40 people almost with their own buses. Uh, what type of staff are you? Are, I, I've noticed there's a lot of people out here helping, but staff-wise, people being a paid profession and coming here and work with the corps. You know about how many people and, and in the drum line specifically? Nobody. We're all just doing it's, this. It's a volunteer thing. All right. Yeah. And uh, how many people are working with the drum line now? Uh, Staff-wise, well, well, I have two. I've had two assistants most of the time. Uh, Adam Slagowski and Steve Fagiano. They're in the snare line. And uh, then I've, uh, on occasion, uh, had my wife Carla Markovich, who is one of my two best students, percussion major, and all you know, taught at the university level. Uh, she's been helping me with, uh, with the line. And then uh, Dave Bork, who's a previous judge, marched with Norwood. Uh, by the way, my wife Carla marched with uh, Argonne Rebels when they were national champions. Oh, yeah. So she's good, you know. But uh, and Dave was the judge, marched with Norwood. He's been helping. And uh, today we have Bill Shutters, who was going to march, but he couldn't. So he's helping. So we got quite a crew out here today. And the background staff, you've got uh, a lot of people I noticed working that used to be in the Royal Airs or were parents of people in the Royal Airs. That's right. And Jackie was the was that the wife of Cy? That was the daughter. Daughter of she's Cy. Cy's daughter. Cy's daughter. Yeah. Uh, she's the she's the core director. And if it wasn't for her, we wouldn't have any. She's put this thing together. And they can search the website on the web for uh, Royal Airs. Just put in Royal Airs and search it. Get the web page on it. Gives the history on it, photographs of it. Yeah. Um, now, from DCI, you, you go on last night. Where are you going from here, from, from DCI? After DCI, uh, we have a um, performance at the Ellington Racetrack in Ellington Heights, Illinois. And uh, when is that? Well, I'm not sure when that is. It's in about a week, I think. Okay. And um, and I won't be here for that one. But then we're going to DCI, Scranton, Pennsylvania. Seniors. Seniors. Yeah. That's it. Okay, that's the final performance. And then, and then either the core will hold at that point, or if there's enough interest and people think we can do this. So you got that on tape now, right? We'll, we'll go another year. They don't, right here is DCI, they're not sure right now. But, that's right. But we got it on tape, so it's, it's going to be made after this season. It's, po it's a possibility. Okay. It's a possibility. Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. All right. You got that, eh? Yeah. All right, well, we can cool. do that. I think that would be what we need. Uh, Royal Airs, Reading Corps 2002. <laughs> uh, you got a video of it. Uh, Rudiments of Drum Set. Right. Okay. Uh, it's advertised in Modern Drummer, Court Magazine, Drum Corps World, VCA program, okay. all the programs. And you marched with the original Royal Airs? Well, the 65. 65 show. <laughs> That's when the guys wrote the key to the national. Right. Hey, Gio. <laughs> and then, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, that's okay. Thanks. Uh, we'll, uh, so in the, in the uh, video, I want to ask you about the video. Uh, you advertise this big time. You've had this video out for how many years? Two years now? Uh, it's going on four. Four years? Yeah. Okay. It's all self-produced, all my self-money, so now, little by little, it's a rough thing doing it. You got no big company behind you. Let's go, guys! All right, well, it's time to go. All righty. Thanks, Steve. Okay.
sticker you got on your heart? Uh, they just issued us these. This is uh, commemorative for Seidler, Nobody does. founder of our corps. And we're all marching for Cy tonight. It's a special show. So they told us we're going to have these over our hearts during the performance. All right. Everybody's got one of those, huh? Yes. Everybody in the corps got one. All right. Uh, you're the big bass drummer. Yes. Yes, I play on the sideline in the pit. All right. How, you, you mind, uh, how old are you? 55. Yeah, in fact, and that's July, the average age, too. July 29th, I just turned 50. All right, that's the average age. All right, very good. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Let's get off by Mitch. We're doing a couple of things with Mitch interview today. Everybody's crazy now? Yeah. Get one with uh, Adam, too. Okay, yeah. Yeah, he's, uh, he's been here. All right, man. Thanks yeah. a lot. Oh, that's all right. No, Have thank a great you. show. It's going to be great. I'll see you. Okay, take care. All right. Take care. Base thank drum, you. huh? Yes, all please. Hi, Hi guys. <laughs> this is the great color guard. All right. Yep. Hey, the light's good, huh? Not bad. All right. Let's, let's just walk them down. Say hi, people. 
Say hi, everybody. Hello. Hello. Everybody got their size stickers on? Hi, Mom and Dad. Hi, Dad. They're inside uniform. Hi, Mom. Hi. Hey, Cisco. Mr. Bob Rivera, how you doing? Good. All right. We're going to come to your house tonight, huh? Yeah. All right. Very good. Hot crowd. Well, that's Cisco. 30,000 people up there for you guys. Okay, hot crowd. You want to go up? When do you get March uh, original? 50 bucks and you can have it. I will autograph it. Oh, all right. Who's the star? Who's the star? Who's the star? That's right. You're the killer. Uh, Michael Jackson. Okay. Killer. Oh, that's a new killer. killer. Hey, no, we all, we all know. Hey, there's that guy. Yeah. He's kicking our ass all the time. Mr. Malaga Solo. Is, uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Have a good one, you guys. Great, great crowd. Walk, walk them right down. Say how big. Estimate, how big. Yeah. Oh, about 30,000. No kidding. Whoa. All right. Oh, you got somebody coming through. All right. Let's go down here. Let's go see the drum line. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let's get the killer solos at the end here. All right, and your name is? Jim Angerwood. Pardon? Jim Angerwood. Jim, and this is? Keith. Keith. These are the two guys at the end of the show. Oh, no, no, no. He's, this guy over here is at the end of the show. I'm in another video. Hi. Chris. Yes. Mike Platt. Hi, Mike. All right, we're just doing some good ones. We're going to put a little editing together. Okay, yeah, cool. Well, so, 30 How come that man doesn't have any clothes on, though? Good. I've got to put some clothes on. I mean, this is embarrassing. <laughs> Well, he wanted to go naked, and that's it. He's from London, England. No. Ah, that's so, well, I don't think he should have, because what he's that's got. Good. <laughs> that's okay. Hey, man, 30,000 people are hot. They're hot. 30,000? Yeah. I'll big. see you at the party. I have that All much right. at dinner time sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Sperlin. Hey. How are you doing? All right. Real good. How you doing, Mike? All right. What years did you watch back when? Oh, oh Jesus. 66. Here we go. Uh, got drafted in 68. All right. All right. There you go, that one. Around 58. Know any good women's? Uh, really no, I just kind of count on you. I, uh, you're the kind of guy you hang around just yeah. to get the leftovers. You know? We're looking for good women's tonight. <laughs> <laughs> There'll be some. There'll be some. It was Don't promised in a letter, man. Don't you, I, my problem? Oh, God, I did. I, oh, well. I, I printed it off the email. I got it. <laughs> All right. Well, have a great show. Thanks. Thank you. Have a great show, you guys. Thank you. Is that spear in that? <laughs> 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 hey! Hey, Steve! Steve! Bye, Jano! Have a good show, man. Of course, man. Uh, yeah, Steve, have a great show. Who was, uh... You got, you got like 30,000 people. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Upper deck, man. Section. This is the section you gotta have, right? Absolutely. And there's a, if there's a way to find shadows or shade, these are the guys who are gonna find it, right? I accept what I remarked. Contrast. Contrast with people. Cold beer. All right, let's go with some names. First name only. Scott. Chuck. Blue. Jeff. Blue. Ronaldo. OFG. Old Pack Guy. Rich. Michael. Blue Devils. Come on. All right. Who is this? Hey, you got some great crowds in the roll call. Let's go, dude. Snares. This is. This is. What's your name? Rich. 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 How you doing? Have a good show. John. John. Have a good show. All right. All right. Rich. Sam. Sam. Yeah. All right. This is Adam. Okay. Yeah, I'm here with the, uh, is this an instructor, or is that how it works? Uh, I think so. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Is he still his brother? Well, no, he's my brother. He's your brother. <laughs> All right. 
You guys got a great crowd out there, about 30,000 people. 30? 30? <laughs> yeah, we'll take it. I think 15,000 is probably really Yeah. <laughs> 30,000. Yeah, you got a lot of people out there. Yeah, at least 15 can yeah, say. Yeah. I'm going to guess they're nice and prime waiting for a yeah, dead face. Well, now they're going to see Drum and Bugle Corps, right? Now it's not a tennis match. Yeah, right. We're yeah. moving. Right. Snares. Yeah. We're moving. Tuning, tuning, tuning. Always tuning. There you go. Mitch Markovich in action. Yeah, have to go, and I'll let you go. Mike, better ask him before running up to the top. I don't know how often he is. I think Mitch is tonight. Bottom. You got you gotta go up top. I'll take the camera. You got time to see the show. You haven't seen it. Well now it's great to see the show. Okay. But it's it's <laughs> bad yeah. to experience the show. Because yeah. you're not gonna get any power. Okay. I like it. Hey, thank you very much. Oh God, I just scared the hell out of you, douche. You guys trying to fix his arm. We got two cars coming in, Garfield and Beep, beep. Truck coming through, guys. Yeah. Beep, beep. 
Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Long line.
having been the greatest organization of its time during the 10 short years of its existence between 1958 and 1968, having attained the status of New York World Third Champion, as well as the only three-time national championship winning drum corps in 1965. The Royal Airs helped to revolutionize the marching music performance and percussion style within the competitive drum corps activity, having introduced the smooth marching and maneuvering style of the block. What are we doing? I don't know. I thought we were going to watch the show. We're never going to see this. Let's go out of the way. Mike, where are you going? We're on the wrong side.